Welcome. Dr. Mandel here with you. A great few minutes of important information. Why your muscles ache, particularly if you are sleep deprived. If you're not sleeping, not only are you affecting your muscles, you're affecting your entire immune system. Remember, when your body's up and alive, cells are dying. If you don't sleep and rest, cells cannot repair and heal. There's no question that lack of sleep will cause more widespread joint and muscle pain. As we age, we begin to develop more muscle aches, more pains, more joint pains. Published in the Arthritis and Rheumatology, they have found that the best predictor of widespread pain is lack of restful sleep. The key link where the majority of studies show on sleep deprivation, this produces hyperalgesic changes. Hyperalgesia occurs when a stimulus that is typically painful is perceived as more painful than it should be. An example might be a simple bump, which ordinarily might be mildly painful, but this sends the chronic pain patient through the roof with serious pain. Again, when the nervous system is in a persistent state of high reactivity, it produces pain that is significantly amplified. Now, this hyperalgesia falls into a category of central sensitization. Central sensitization is a condition of the nervous system that's associated with the development and maintenance of chronic pain. When central sensitization occurs, the nervous system goes through a process called wind up and it gets regulated in a persistent state of high reactivity. This persistent or regulated state of reactivity lowers the threshold of what causes pain and subsequently comes to maintain pain even after the initial injury might have healed. This central sensitization has been long recognized as a possible consequence of many, many conditions. It can occur in chronic lower back pain, chronic neck pain, whiplash injuries, chronic tension headaches, migraine headaches, rheumatoid arthritis, osteoarthritis of the knee, endometriosis, fibromyalgia, irritable bowel syndrome, and post-surgical conditions. Now, experts believe that the reason to believe that the cascade of physiological problems caused by poor sleep contributes to pain is that it's pro-inflammatory. That means that the body is secreting cortisol, which is our stress hormone. When we get up in the morning, our cortisol levels are high, giving us that energy to get through the day. But at night, cortisol levels are supposed to be low. However, if your cortisol levels do not decrease in the evening because the stress response is triggered and it doesn't shut off cortisol production, this is what leads to real serious issues. Understand that cortisol has a profound effect on the entire biology. It affects our endocrine system, which produces all our hormones, including our thyroid hormone, which regulates metabolism, our insulin, which regulates blood sugar, our sex hormones, which is our estrogen and progesterone and testosterone, which regulates sexual function, your menstrual cycles and menopause. Cortisol has a profound effect on our digestion and our immune system. It also affects the neurotransmitters, the brain's chemicals that determines energy, mood, mental clarity, focus, and sleep. It plays a significant role in weight gain. It's a major contributor to anxiety and depression. When our cortisol levels are at optimal levels, this is when we mentally feel sharp, we're clear, we're motivated. But when our cortisol levels are off, this is when we feel foggy, fatigued, tired, this is a serious issue. Remember that cortisol affects our blood pressure, our circulation, our cardiovascular system. It affects our pancreas with insulin. It affects our lungs, our bones, and even our skin and hair. But although if these cortisol levels are off, those muscles are going to continue to ache because of that excessive inflammation. So how do you know that you're lacking sleep? If you're having symptoms of sleepiness, mood changes, difficulty concentrating, uh, impaired performance, your memory is just not there. You can't think analytically. You're disoriented. You're kind of foggy. 
and even having difficulty sleeping because you're so far behind in your sleep. You need to make changes. Please take this serious. I ask you to share this video. Share it with those on your social media. There are millions of people out there that will benefit from this. I ask everyone out there to make it a great day. I'm Dr. Alan Mandel.